Hi everybody at Bird the Green, it is Mr. Palmer here. I hope you are all keeping well. We're on to week six of our home skills challenges, okay? Um, again, we're going to try something a little bit different. All right, last, last week we did our home circuit challenge. Today we are going to do our home speed challenge, okay? Where you're going to keep testing yourself at the same thing, timed throughout the week. I hope you really enjoy it. I hope everyone's keeping well. For you guys that are at home, make sure you're practicing this lots and lots. I know the teachers and the out here. For you guys in school, we can practice this as well, okay? Really, really easy to get out. A few cones and get this done, okay? And have a little challenge between you guys that are in school still too. So make sure we're all giving it a good go, okay? It's a tough one, this one. It really get you out of breath and make you work very, very hard, okay? But it'll keep us nice and fit. Nice and healthy, okay? So, good to see you all, all right? I hope you're all keeping well, and I will see you guys as soon as possible. So, guys, on our speed challenge this week, we are going to be focusing on your SAQ movements, which are your speed, agility, and quickness. To set this little circuit, little session up, you are going to need five markers. Now, I've used cones. Again, you can use anything around the house, just make sure you've asked your parents first if it's okay to use. All right, something nice and small and soft, ideally. Okay, if you've got cones, fantastic. All right, and you're going to set them up in a little square. Okay, so it's a one stride square. Okay, with one cone in the center. Okay, we're going to work a little square circuit. It's all going to be about how quickly we can move our feet. Really fast, small contact on the floor. Quick change of direction. Once we complete one lap of this box, that gets us one point. Okay, you're going to get one minute to score as many full points, full circuit laps as you can, and then try and complete and beat that throughout the week. So let us walk through first. If you start from any one of your corner cones, we're going to keep our bodies facing forward at all times, never turn around. We are going to come around that centre cone each time. Now you can go every, any way you like. You've got to complete all four, get back to the start. So you watch. I'm going to ground there. I'm going to twist my body, come back around this one. And then work around it again. And round the top. Come back around again to go around this one. And then I'm going to get myself back into position at number one. That would be one circuit done. So if I show you that now nice and quickly, see how I'm on my toes and I'm working my arms in tandem with my feet. Work out, wrap across, and around, all different types of movement, good. Working there, and I get back to the starting position. That's one. Two, and so on and so forth, as many as you can do inside one minute. Now you can tell this is gonna be really tough, okay? It's gonna get you out of breath, okay? It's gonna make you really, really get yourself working hard. So stick at it, have a go at it, wait a little bit, try another, try and beat your score, okay? You're doing great with these at the minute, make sure you keep it up. It's a good job from everybody. Hope to see you all soon, good luck.